Yes, we we probably got the biggest W of the year in this box right here. I'm about to unbox probably the biggest retail W of the year. I mean, it's probably way too early to even say that because I think, I mean, what do we got? Like five months still left in the year of 2021. But this is by far one of the craziest uh, W's. I don't know how many people, I'm pretty sure a lot of people hit on these. Maybe, let me know in the comments if you guys hit on these. If you guys got them for retail or if you guys are paying resale. Um, I think right now is a good time to get them. But then again, it's never a good time when you gotta pay resale. This shoe here, man, it's my favorite out of the two. You guys know the Taupe, the Taupe uh, Union 4's release alongside with the Desert Moss. I was lucky enough to hit on Union. Uh, they sent me a, a invoice, and as soon as I seen that invoice, bro, like I could not believe it. For some reason, I just had something telling me though in my gut, like I was like, like you're gonna get this one. I don't know, I don't know what it was, but something about myself was just super confident. I just kept checking my emails. Uh, just the, the second that I put in for the raffle, I just kept checking my emails like every two hours, bro. Like just looking, 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 and there it was, dude. Like late Sunday night, I just get an uh, email saying that you know. Uh, it was a, to finish my payment or whatever. It was like an invoice and I just could not believe it. Dude, I'm super grateful. I'm super happy. We're going to open these up and we're going to throw them on feet. I'm not going to take too much time. I'm kind of uh, excited to see these and I'm kind of curious or I guess interested in seeing the color patterns on this. I think the colors are a little bit uh, crazy. Um, there's one color specifically that's uh, that's a little bit uh, uh, crazy to me that they threw on this shoe. Two colors, of course, they go well together big shout out to union la like i was saying um you guys made my year this is this made my year man if i don't get anything else after this i got these for retail and like i said it just made my year i'm happy dude like i'm happy i'm not gonna complain i can't complain anymore because i got a retail grab bro that you know retail was like 250 after uh after fees i think after shipping fees and stuff so dude here it is man i still can't believe i'm opening this box up bro i still can't believe it all right i, I thought it was too good to be true there's nothing else inside the box if you guys are like me, like, dude, I, I just thought I was going to get a cancellation. I just thought that maybe they accidentally sent me a dub. Like, I was just like, no way, bro. They just sent me a W. Like, I heard that there's still a sneakers at release. Uh, I would believe so. Um, just because it just seems like there's a lot of pairs. So, I think there might be a sneakers at release. Uh, don't quote me. I'm not 100% sure. And I don't work for Nike. Or I don't have any kind of inside scoop. I'm literally just the guy in the middle of Kansas, bro. This reads Air Jordan 4 Retro SP. Uh, Desert Moss turquoise blue that's the color that I was telling you guys that I'm just curious to see um, how it kind of looks uh, together mixed in with these other colors um, turquoise blue is gonna be I think on the pull tab around that area and a little bit out uh, more throughout the shoe uh, price tag 225 like I said I paid 250 um, you know you got the Michael Jordan's uh, you know hands right here it says Union um, like I said, dude, I did hear um, Keith Adams. Shout out to you, bro. You, I, I am a huge fan. I've been watching Keith since he was he had a few thousand subs. Huge YouTuber, um, and he did say that. Uh, and I kind of felt bad, bro, because uh, he kind of threw some bad shade at Union LA. But I, you know, hey man, much love to Keith, bro. But dude, this was nothing like the trophy room release. If a guy in the middle of Kansas, and then I got another buddy that lives like an hour from me, he hit as well. So if two dudes from the middle of nowhere in Kansas got W's, and I also know my boy Floyd Chavez hit on the Topes uh, up in Cali, you know, if there's people that I actually know that actually hit legitimately, then you know, this was nothing like the Union, or like the Trophy Room release, I'm sorry. Um, so yeah, dude, hopefully, you know, maybe he'll apologize to Union. But yeah, a lot of us did hit, a lot of us people who collect sneakers and love sneakers, we did hit. Um, and a lot of resellers as well, you know, they got they got lucky and they hit too, man. It is what it is, bro. It's a sneaker game. Welcome to it. Um, let's open this box up. And on the bottom of the box, I don't see any kind of stamps. Uh, not up to my uh, sights, bro. I don't I don't see no stamps or nothing like that. Um, you guys see the box right there, the bottom lid. Um, and of course, you know, you guys, a couple videos ago, I was unboxing the guava ice, the guavas. I was unboxing the guavas, and now we got these, bro. Isn't that crazy? Here is the paper. That's what it's going to look like. Um, you know, we've got Michael Jordan with this full set of hair. Let's peel this open, because I'm super excited, bro, and I already got a glimpse of them. Woo, bruh. Dude, here they are. Desert Moss, Union 4s. Air Jordan 4, Desert Moss, Unions, dude, ah, unbelievable, unbelievable, unbelievable. I can't believe it. 
Here is the shoe. Shoelaces. Oh, okay, I was gonna say shoelaces are unattached, but they're not unattached, they're attached. I, I just seen them laying in the middle of the box, but dude, shoelaces are attached. Let's see if there's any stamps inside. Okay, so you are going to get a YDM or whatever, is it YDM? Yeah, YDM or YCM, I don't know what it says. I think it's YDM, I always say YDM, but it's right here in the box. <sighs> here they are, guys, here they are. Let's move the lid aside. For retail, guys, for retail, we got them here, dude. Oh my God. Like I said, the back pull tab is in that turquoise that it sit on the box. Um, it, this is like that harvest yellow, but a little, maybe a little a little touch of brown in there is, is what I'm seeing right now. Um, but it does give you that LA vibe. It gives you like, honestly, you know, um, it does give you like a, kind of like a, a hiking shoe type vibe, you know, with the, with the shoelaces and everything. Um, the wings, you know, are all cleared out. Oh man, this shoe is nice, guys. I gave this shoe so much crap last year, dude. Last year, whenever the Nors and the Guavas came out, I gave it so much crap, and I take it all back, dude. Like, I, I, I bite my tongue now, because, dude, like, I had to bite my tongue, because, dude, these things are beautiful. The other pairs were beautiful. Once you put them on feet, you know, it just makes a whole lot of difference. That purple is just, dude, it just pops so nice. The turquoise. It, it, that, that, that's one color that I could have done without, man. All right, let's take this back, man. I was about to get this shoe ready to do it on feet, right? And I asked my girl, I said, dude, come check these out. These things are freaking awesome. And she came into the room to check them out, and she's like, I was like, doesn't it give you like a Lakers vibe? I was like, it's like that harvest, like goldish yellow and purple. She's like, I think you're colorblind. I was like, what do you mean? She's like, it, th that doesn't look yellow at all. And like, I don't know, I think it looks yellow. So she looked up the color wheel and what desert moss was like actually like around and it's actually like a greenish color and now I could actually see like the green. Had she not pointed that out I would have not known man. So on StockX it has like a picture of the shoe and anywhere else when you guys see these shoes and pictures like they look like a yellow but it's really not dude. It, it really is like a brownish uh, greenish look. It's not really a uh, it's not a yellow. Um, on the bottom, you are going to get that yellow right there on the outsole. You guys see that right there. You are going to get that yellow right there on the bottom. But yeah, uh, for the most part, yeah, the color blocking is is definitely uh, like a greenish, uh, I guess greenish yellowish, you could say. That I think that would be fair to say with the purple. Uh, the sock liner is gray. Um, just the back, you know, you got that Nike Air on the back. Let me show you guys that real quick. And that's in, in that uh, nice kind of an earth tone purple. So yeah, the shoe is very beautiful, dude. Like the shoe is awesome. I think it's a very nice shoe. You guys are gonna love this shoe, man. Like I said, I'm super fortunate to hit guys. Uh, just an amazing sneaker, man. And I did take this apart here. Um, I took that off already. So yeah, I'm gonna be throwing these on feet for you guys. There's the hang tag. Um, just super happy to hit for retail, man. It feels amazing. Um, and I hope you guys get to experience that sometime, you know, your sneaker collecting uh, life. Uh, you know, I hope you guys get to experience a big W um, because it feels really good, man. Let me show you guys the shoelaces up close. There you guys see that, the extra laces. There you guys see the air unit. Nice little air unit. Inside, I don't know if you guys can really make out the inside of that, but super happy to have them. Let's put these things on feet for you guys. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you're new. It's your boy Jay. I'm out of here, man. Stay safe. Ladies. Thank you.